App State heads to Kyle Field and man alive. Uh, do we have a, a thing here? App State coming off of an emotional home loss. They thought they had that game won multiple times uh, against North Carolina. And now they get to go on the road to a team who actually has a defense. That's the biggest thing for Texas A&M. A&M, by the way, a 19-point favorite at home. Total is 54. Latest line over at BetUS. This is a 3.30 p.m. Eastern time game. It's on ESPN2. Uh, looking at some of the trends here. App State minus, uh, excuse me, App State 1-6 and six against the spread. Their last seven on the road against a winning team. And they are also 0-4 against the spread. Their last four non-conference games. That does not bode well in this situation. Texas A&M 6-1 against the spread following a spread loss. And they are 16-5 and five against the spread in their last 21 non-conference games. Jimbo Fisher likes to run up the score if he's given the opportunity. Chase Bryce made North Carolina's defense look silly last week. But when Chase Bryce goes up against a really good defense, it, things have not gone well. We'll just say that. And Texas A&M does have a really good defense. I mean, they are going to out-athlete App State on a level that they didn't even come close to seeing last week at home. Uh, I am going to take Texas A&M. I think a lot of people want to buy into this App State thing because they put up so many points last week. <laughs> there is a chasm of difference between Texas A&M and North Carolina. It's not even close. And the only way that I could see App State covering this is if you get multiple Haynes King turnovers. Now, that is not outside the realm of possibilities, but... I don't foresee it happening. I see Texas A&M trying to establish the run more in this game. Uh, Chase Bryce making a few mistakes, and that will lead to, you know, 21 to 24 point victory for Texas A&M, and it'll be a snoozer. That's just the way that I'm seeing it. This is not anything against you, App State. Just the way that I see this game going, especially coming off of a uh, loss like that. I mean, it's it's situational, situational for sure. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.